Our CES 2018 coverage is powered by GoDaddy. Please support our coverage by going to geeknewscentral.com forward slash GoDaddy. Good morning, Frank, and you're with Skylink, Skylink Group. Correct. So tell me what you have here for us this morning. What we're introducing uh, this year at the CES is our Nova. Uh, Nova is an all-in-one retrofit for a garage, for an existing garage door. Okay. So if you have an existing older, you know, 10, 20 years, you want to make it into a smart garage opener yeah. that you can control from your phone and your apps. I think my garage door has been in my house since I bought it. Yeah, Probably so about 20 years. Yeah, 20 years. A lot years. of those old clunkers still clicking away. Yeah, matter of fact, I disconnected it because I think there was a security concern at one time for it. Correct. Yeah. Yeah, because now the new, all the remotes have rolling code to yeah, yeah, and yeah. all that stuff. So a lot of people that want to make this, your, you know, you'd like to know if your door is open or closed yeah. and you'll be able to control it. Yep. Well, this will retrofit the, an existing door, an existing garage door opener. Awesome. So it works pretty well. Anything that's on the market that has a, an existing uh, door, push button doorbell switch. Sure, sure. So anything like that. Um, so all, all you do is just two wires yep. plugged in from the back of this to the push button. You tap them in with your wall button that yep. you control your door right now. And you plug it into the power, and that's it. Once you download the app, you have full control from your phone. Okay. To open, close, monitor, you get notification if your door is open, when, who, who opened there, when they opened it. My neighbor uh, just the other night left their door open, and they forgot it was open all night, and they had a robbery. Exactly. So that's, that's well, even if you're away and somebody breaks into your garage door, or you forget, accidentally like, leave it open. Right. That's what happens. Also, not only does that, but there's a lot more to this and just similar other uh, products on the market. Yep. This is also expands into a full home automation alarm system. Wow. So there's a hub in here that you can control, and you can add all sorts of window sensors, motion sensors, uh, cameras, water detectors, lighting. To this device? Really? All, all to this device. This device controls all uh, lighting switches, uh, wall switches, plugs in, smart plugs, um, so it's a whole base station. A whole then. base station. Yeah, it's a full hub. Yeah. Uh, so you can do alarm security and home automation with it. I got gotcha. you. The other part also has a built-in bright LED light. Yep. So once you, this is normally mounted on your ceiling in the garage. Yep. Next to your garage opener. Sure. There's usually a plug out there. Yeah. So all you do is plug it into the outlet. Yeah. Run two wires from here to the garage. Yep. Tap it in, and you're done. You can, if we want to plug it in, we can, there's a very bright light. Yeah, we probably, we probably, can, yeah. Here. If we, we, we can plug it in if we need to, but you can remotely turn it on. This is your, you can also open your door from here. Okay. With the keychain remote. Yep. And finally, the other part that's really important and safe, it has a carbon dioxide, carbon Wait. monoxide smoke detector alarm detector. So it doesn't sense the carbon monoxide or smoke, but it senses your alarm. Okay. So if your smoke alarm goes off or your carbon monoxide alarm goes off, there's a sensible microphone in here that picks up that beeping. Right. That certain beep, 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 beep yep. that they, they send. And that at that time, it'll open your door. Really? For additional ventilation. Oh, that's smart. So it's really a full smart home retrofit for existing uh, garage. But not only for, I mean, if you don't use that garage part... It gets so, control so of it, a whole bunch does of it, it opens the door on CO2. Does it open oh, the smoke. door... On fire as well? Probably not, right? Because you don't well, want that to happen. Because no, you're it's a smoke smoke detector. Smoke detector. So if you have smoke or CO detection, right, right, it'll right. It'll open the door for additional ventilation. I got gotcha. you. So completely, you've got home automation, lighting, smart plugs, right. camera surveillance. You have security, window door sensors. Uh, you have water detection sensors. Okay. Um, you have, uh, and you control your door. The other thing on top of all that, it's fully compatible with uh, Amazon Alexa, okay. IFTTT, yep. and Google Home. Awesome. So you can control from your, say, Alexa, mm -hmm. open my garage, uh, close my garage door, Yep. Alexa, do whatever you need to do. What is the retail on this? Retail price will be launching at uh, under $100. Under $100. Yeah. And when's the availability going to be? Be available spring 2018. In spring of 18. Yeah. And they can, I assume, okay, Skylink Home. Home.com is the is place. Website. Yeah. Yep. All right. Very uh, cool. We have. We'll be available, of course, through all sorts of retailers and. So the the alarm addition to this will be obviously an upcharge on that on a monthly fee. Um, this is a self monitor. Do it yourself self monitoring. Right. We will uh, 
provide monitoring services. Okay. Ten, fifteen dollars a month. Yeah. yeah, that's your choice. But you can primarily people do it on a self monitor. You get instant notification over of, your cell phone. Over your cell phone of window sensors, door, any motion sensor, time, and who armed and disarmed the system. Right. And uh, location of the window sensor. Plus, you get a status as you see here on your uh, on the little app of the. Uh, I don't know if you can see it on the phone. The red means motion sensor is activated. Okay. And yeah. The red door means it's open. The others are blue, which are closed. Awesome. So you can see it. Well, this, I tell you what, it's uh, almost the point now where you, you almost don't need an alarm company because the cameras in the home, the sensors in the home. You have everything. You have everything now. You know, because if you're if you can, like here I'm CES, and if I had an alert go off, I might not be able to respond immediately. But generally, you'll be able to see something's going on. And exactly. Yeah. Even when you do have monitoring system, and monitoring system is a peace of mind. But when you do have a monitoring system. The company generally calls you. That's right. And it asks you, what do you want to do? That's right. They, they so always that, call me, say, what's your password? I right. have to give them the password. So yeah. You eliminate that delay of them getting the call, yeah. dialing and calling. You already got that notification yep. on your phone that the, uh, yep. the the intrusion has happened or yep. something has happened there. Yeah, in Hawaii, if you have more than two false alarms, it costs you money. Exactly. <laughs> the app is uh, available on iOS and uh, Android. Okay. Of course, uh, multiple users can use the app, up to six users. All right. The uh, the devices, can you can add up to 100 sensors. Okay. And you're, so That's amazing. Lots of doors and windows and lighting. Um up to six users can use up to six cameras as well. Ten cameras and six users can have the app. And the sensors on that are available again uh, currently through that way we carry through a Skylink Home. Outstanding. Well. Skylinkhome.com, uh, folks. That's the that. place to go. Frank, for, thanks for being thank here. Thank you very much. Thank yeah, you for Thank being. you and uh, appreciate it and have a good show. We certainly will. All thank right. You. Appreciate it.